What is up guys? It's Soul Bash. We are back again with some more Mobile Legends. And I told you I would show you some of these skins and stuff. Okay, so here's uh, Dread. I've got him and he does have skins. Uh, this is one of the unlock currently D-Rock. Uh, Pyrex, I've got him from a roll. Striker. And they all do have different skins, but I'm going to go with Dread. I'm going to show you some Dread gameplay today. And room cases, I'll have to go over that in a completely separate video because it's not really complex. It's just a lot of stuff to talk about. And we're ready for five seconds. Then it's going to count down again. All right, I'm not sure what's the deal with the names are, but uh, they were friends that were on my friends list. And now acting a little weird. It is still the beta version. See, we're gonna grab this skill. This skill right here, what it does is it throws the axe out and deals damage and then stuns the target for one and a half seconds and decreases their movement speed by 20%. That's the first thing I'm gonna go with. And I'll show you what it does because we're gonna need it right up here. This is 3v3s versus other people and they made it before we did. Seems like the red side is a lot closer than the other side. All right, we're gonna go in, clean up, get my heal out, save my guy. Gotta kill this Sakura. Oh, I didn't get it off. All right, we're gonna have to stun him and run. Hopefully we can get out. We didn't get out. I'm gonna show you something cool though, once we get his ulti. All right, let's get back in. Nice thing is you get the speed boost, runs you straight back into battle. All right, so it's two up top. All right, one of our guys is down bottom. So it seems like all three of them are kind of hanging together. So we need to pop down here. All right, here we come from the bottom. I'm gonna wait for the power up. And he got it. All right, here we go. All right, if he times a stun just right, got him. He's done. No, he can't get away. I didn't get the hill off in time either. All right, so we need to regroup. Not many games will start out with the downtime of you know, somebody else getting more kills than me. All right, we're not gonna be able to do this alone with her. She's got some high burst damage. All right, here we go. Stun Sakura, disappear. Other guy comes up from behind, nice. All right, my stun will be back up soon. Oh, and I'm stuck. I'm out of mana as well. All right, so we need to go back to base. I need mana and help. All right, here we go. Let's run top, help him real quick. All right, here comes another one. I hope he wasn't trying to get down and escape from that. Sakura's got him. Ember blinked. Come on, Alpha's a pretty good guy. Uh, we've been playing against him quite a bit. Oh, uh, let me get that heal off. Not in time, the Sakura came back out of nowhere. Pick me off. All right, we got our third ability now. This is starting out really slow with the abilities. Well, once we get the ultimate, things will turn around quite a bit. It is pretty awesome. Let's see if we can catch somebody slacking. Alpha Wolf again, he's taking damage. I'm not sure where the rest of his team was. Oh, they were up here. So it's going to be an easy pick off for all of these. Now we have the ultimate. It is on now. This is fun. This is where it gets really fun with Dread. So what Dread's ultimate is, is it's a passive. All right. And what it does is if I die, I resurrect and come back to life with full mana and full health. Now, it is on a timer. It can only happen every so often 
I believe it's like 110 seconds. Uh, let's see if we can get him stunned. Stun in. Uh, we didn't time that really good enough. We still got him though. It's like 110 second resurrection though. So basically, every 110 seconds, or less than two minutes, I'm able to not really die, but come back full health. And I'm gonna show you how that works pretty soon probably, because we're getting in a little crazy, getting dangerously close to. See, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bait him. I'm gonna let him heal up. I should grab this heal myself. All right. I like staying lower health but around that area because it kind of baits people to come in to think they can kill you. Like Sakura right here. I'm dangerously low, so they're gonna try to go after me. Slam me. He's trying to get me. All right, he didn't. And we'll go up with another X. All right, boss just spawned. We're not gonna kill him quite yet. Actually, need to go back and get some health, so let's go ahead and do that. One on bottom, two top. We got one of our guys in the jungle, so I'm gonna split them. See who needs the help. Down, down, down. Coming in for the save. Take him out. All right, he's got me stunned. Stay focused on me. Stay focused on me. Okay, good. All right, the other guy showed up. Nice. Five more kills and we win. All right, here we go. Told you things would turn around. Oh, can we get him? Can we? Uh, he would, he would have died anyway. All right, four more. I guess we're not even really progressing or pushing towards the towers a whole lot. We're just taking out the kills. First to 20 wins. Oh, get back here. Wait. Okay, so I've, I gotta show you the ability. So I'm gonna go down here by myself. Let's go ahead and kill this stuff off. And I won't dread the, I want her to kill me. Well, I guess she won't. Um, we'll get one of them too. Let's go in here dangerously close and just, well, we got all the kills. All right, so anyway, his ability is still cool. I'll have to show you again. All right, I'm sure we're going to run another one immediately. All right, and I want to show you this as well. These are cards. You get five flips every day after your arena fights, and you can get shards and you can get runes. And that's what I could have gotten. I could have got two different shards. So you could get legend shards from it. We're almost up to the next veterancy, which is uh, amateur five. And there's the statistics. I had two deaths, six kills, two deaths, 12 assists. And let's go back. And there we go. All right, getting settled back in. We'll do another one and we'll go with Dread again. We'll go ahead and hit ready. And here's Dread skin, there's one of them that you can get the Pirate King Dread, and that is a pretty awesome skin. I'm really thinking about getting that. Well put together, awesome. And as you can see, revived the original location. That's the uh, ultimate I was talking about. There we go, we're against uh, different people this time. So getting a lot better with getting matches. Things are starting to progress a lot faster because people are actually playing more now because a lot more people have it and it's going to get better and better the more people that get on and we should be able to get the power up to begin with it's the first thing everybody goes for and that's usually where the first fight starts now especially between people that know you know what's going on like i'm gonna entice them i'm just gonna go ahead and go in stun not scared all right we got the power up Get a stun on him. Heal everybody, heal everybody. Okay. All right, we got one down. Get this next one. All right. Uh, can I get this? If I get the stun on him, we can, might get him. Yeah, we're gonna get him. It's gonna be a clear three out. 
first run. All right, he's back up already. I'm low health. I have no abilities. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and go back. And we find a little cool trick with that too. Show you just, check this out. All right, this was found out by, I believe, Vinny. You just go in a circle like that and it follows you. That's pretty cool. All right, here we go, top lane. So there's only one up here, which is Jonic. I need to get some levels. Come here, little guy. I need to kill you. Get off me. All right, here we go. Got our life tap. That's a passive ability right here. As you can see, absorption. All allies legends get a 7% lifestyle bonus. Every time you level it up, it goes up another 7%. So it goes to 14 and then 21% life steal, which is pretty nice. It starts getting to where, you know, you can go to the jungle and attack stuff and kind of heal yourself up, you know, and unlock that one, which is more of a attack, have a 15% chance to deal 1.7 times, 1.75 times critical hit. So that's just more damage, 15% chance. I'm not sure what the increase rate on it is. Just trying to get that guy to go down there, and we did. Well, we can finish clearing that out. And let's check down here, see how he is. I know I'm at half health. So is he. All right, here we go. Stay on him. Good job. Stun. Got him. Good job. All right. Well, let's go ahead and take this stuff out. If I get level four, I unlock my ulti, so we'll go ahead and do that. Nice. All right. So now I have to actually show you the ulti. And I'll, I'll if I have to purposely go die, I will. Uh-oh, somebody got a kill. Let's take a look. <laughs> nice thing about this too, guys, is you can actually... Oh, all three of them here. This is where I show you how it works. Now they're going to run away normally thinking I'm dead, but I'm going to slip out the bottom. I just came back to life. How about that? All right. So that's how that ability works. It's pretty cool. Uh, the people don't know about dread, you know, most of the time they just run off, especially if you've been sitting there fighting and they actually, you know, kill you and you actually don't die. It doesn't give you, uh, uh doesn't give the other team anything. All right, here we go. Here we go. All three rushing up. Oh, oh, he's toast. He's toast. Sakura came in out of nowhere. All right, we got a stun on Sakura. Got a heal off on my guy, stun him. I ran into his. Get rid of that. All right. We're 10 to two. And let's go ahead and upgrade the X. Get more damage from it. I need to get to where I can time that with him. Get the best results out of it. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. You're not killing him. Now you're running. Ooh, get him, get him, get him, get him. Got him. Ooh, that was close. Oh, I was out of range of that. That's cool. 11-3. So I actually died again and we can upgrade that. See now we are at 21% life still bonus, which is pretty nice. So pretty much anything farming in the bottom, you know, midsection, which we need to actually help right back here. So I'm going to swoop in. Looks like he's trying to run. Got the stun on him. Nice. Um, are we ready for him? Well, you know what? 
yeah this gives a pretty good chunk of change uh especially for upgrades so it's really nice to try to you know kill it every time especially being the tank because i mean you don't really get a whole lot of kills you get more assist than anything but it's still fun you still could do a lot of damage and actually you know what i'll go ahead and use the skill i don't care this is a nice upgrade oh they healed me uh oh I'm not dead, son. All right, here we go. That power up should have been saved from one of them. This is my bad. That tower's down. All right, let's all push top. Go ahead and take this tower out, which will give us our give us our legend, uh, our power troops. Nice. Here we go. Let's take it out. Super minions. Yeah, that's what it deploys. So just have more hit points. Bigger. That's where their stuff spawns. And that's where they spawn. Right in there. Come here, guy. Get your stun on. Secure coming out the side. He's dead. Secure, you're dead too. Booyah! All right, let's get the axe leveled up because we're gonna need that. All right, they got a few things in to take a hit. I got 34 seconds left on my resurrection. So we're gonna get out on the bottom side. Oh, we got the kill. Nice. All right, guys, level up, veteran C5, nice. Pretty cool. And on the victory screen, you can actually control your guy. You can spin him, that's pretty cool. All right, so we are going to be moving on to the next veterancy soon. I want to thank these guys for uh, helping me with these fights. You know, you got to be in the team with somebody to be able to actually get veterancy. We have learned that. Um, and the next level we're going to, we're going to skilled after we get through veterancy five, uh, amateur veterancy five. Yeah. So skilled is the next one. Um, and there's become a lot of people on here now. Uh, level wise, we're sitting in the number one spot for level total power. We're sitting in the number two spot and rank. So we know there's at least, you know, two to 3,000 people that are actually have the game now and able to play. So it's only going to get better. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions about this game, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Also, the link is still in the description for pre-registration for this. If you pre-register, you do get in-game rewards uh, worth like $5. So it's uh, the crystals and some other stuff. So it's pretty cool. Go pre-register for it. And like I said, thank you for watching, guys. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day. Yeah. <laughs>